Stay safe. Stay active. And stay healthy. <laughs>
Uh, so, so you should fill that down here. Good. Arm across. And then your other arm. Um, one hand goes behind on your neck and then the other arm is going to hold that elbow. Nice deep breathing while we're doing this and swap over. Excellent. And just shake your body off. Okay. Perfect, well done. Right then guys, so now we are going to be taking our heart rate again. So now we've done a warm up, we're gonna see how much our heart rate has gone up. Okay, so can you find your pulse? You know, over your neck or on your wrist. If you need to pause the video and find it, then pause it here. Right, again, I'm going to count 10 seconds. I want you to count them beats. Are we ready? And go. One, two. And stop. So that number, I would like you to try and times that by six and then put that below the number you did before. Okay, you may need to write next to it what you've what you've done beforehand so at the start your first one should be your start starting um pulse okay and then your next one should be after your warm-up and then so on after every activity that we do you'll need to write what activity you've done and then what it is so we should now have done that okay so we are now going to look at interval training okay now interval training is something that we do okay when we try to it's, uh, benefits are it's nice and efficient okay if we need to lose weight then it's a very quick way of losing some weight okay and it's very very good for the body especially our hearts okay so what it involves is alternating periods of high and low intensity of activity so that would mean being really fast with something and then stopping and having a rest and then going back to it and doing it again. We're going to be doing six activities which are going to be speed bounce, star jumps, bicycle legs, press ups, sit ups and tricep dips. Okay, so they're the six that we're going to be doing today. I will show you before we do them just in case you don't know what they are. I'm so, I'll be I'm sure that most of you will know what they are anyway, okay? So, with interval training, before we start, it can be done with any form of exercises, okay? So, you don't just have to use these ones, okay? It could be anything. If you do sit-ups, okay? Sp uh, sprinting from cone to cone and things like that, okay? So, you can do it lots of different exercises. Now, the first one that we're going to do is our speed bound. So I would like you to go and find an object to jump over. Okay, I'm going to use a sock. So I'm going to put a sock on the floor. Okay, as a line so that I am ready to jump over it. Okay, when you're ready, once you've found that, then stand up. I'll just, uh, if you need to pause it to go and find something, then pause it here. Right, so we should be ready now to go. So we're gonna do this for 30 seconds, okay? You don't need to count how many times you do it. I'm just gonna put a timer on the phone so we know how long we've got to do it for. Uh, right, are we all ready? So we should have a line to jump over. When you're ready, three, two, one, and go. So. Just jumping over. As many times as you can. Try not to hit that line. If 
Use your arms if you need to. Depends how big your object is. If your object's bigger, you would need to use your arms more. And stop there. So, I now want you to take a 15 second break. Ready and go. So you can either just walk around or hands behind your head, nice deep breathing. Getting all that air in. Good, and now this time, we're going to do it for 20 seconds. So we've done our activity, we've had a little bit of a rest. Now we're gonna do it again. So, are we all ready? 20 seconds, and go. Keep working, keep going. And stop there, well done, good work. Again, nice deep breaths. Hands by your head, nice deep breaths in. If you need to, walking around. Right, now I would like you to take your heart rate again. So, find your pulse. Pause it here if you need to find it. If you found it, we're going to do for 10 seconds again. Ready and go. And stop. So whatever that number was, times up by six and then put a record of it on your bit of paper. Again, we might want to write speed bounce before. Right, our next one is going to be star jumps. Okay, so again, we're going to do that for 30 seconds. So we've had a bit of a break in between. Okay, so we're going to do some nice big star jumps this time. So you might want to move your object out of the way. You don't need anything for this one. Are we all ready? And go. Keep going, keep working, three, two, one, and stop. Again, take a little walk around, hands behind your head, nice deep breaths. Getting that air in, breathing in, and out. Good. Right, we're gonna do another 20 seconds. I'll be ready. We've had our 15 second break. And go. Five, four, three, two, one, and stop. Excellent, again. Take a little break. Should be nice. I'm worn out now. I'm especially worn out. Okay, so get that breathing going. In through the nose and out through the mouth. Good. Once you've done that, find your pulse. And again, we're gonna take our heart rate, okay? So find your pulse. If you need to pause the video to find it, then we'll pause it here. And go. And stop there, excellent. Right then guys, so we are now, we've had our break again, okay, so we are now going to do our bicycle leg. So this time you are going to lay on the floor, okay, and then 
you're going to lift up your legs, okay, and you're going to be like you're pedaling on a bike, okay, and we're going to do that for 30 seconds, so get into your ready position, I'll get a timer going, right, 30 seconds, are we ready, three, two, one, and go, keeping them legs moving as if you're riding a bike okay keep your back flat on the floor okay if you can go fast so that is fine okay you haven't got to okay as long as your legs are moving and cycling very good for your core this one keep going and stop there again sit up though this time in through the nose out through the mouth we're gonna have 15 seconds break and then we're gonna go for another 20 seconds in through the nose out through the mouth well done excellent right back down are we ready go back into that position and go again keeping that back flat on the floor Keeping them legs pumping. Okay, good. Keep going. Five seconds. And stop there. Again, sitting up. In through the nose. Out through the mouth. In through the nose. Out through the mouth. Well done. Excellent work, guys. Can you now find your pulse? Okay. If you need to pause the video to find it, that's fine. And when you're ready, and go. And stop. So write that now. Keep that number in your head, times it by six to get your heart rate. Good, and you should be finding what can you see in your results so far. Right, our next one. Now with press ups, okay, you can either do it normal press up, but I would normally say, I would say it's easier to cross your feet, go on your knees, and then doing it that way. Okay, if you want to try it the other way, that is fine. Right, we're going to do 20 seconds, okay, and then have a rest in between like we do, and then we're going to go for another lot after. Are we ready? So get into your starting position, I'm going to do it on the knees, like I suggest, everyone else does. Are we ready? And go. Not got to be fast, make sure we're doing it properly. Five, four, three, two, one, and stop there. Again, in through the nose, out through the mouth. 15 seconds starts now. Okay, if you need to stretch, that is fine. Again, if you need to walk, get up and walk around, that is fine as well. Well done, excellent. Right, back into position. We're gonna do another 20 seconds this time. Okay, so feet crossed at the back on your knees. Ready and go. And stop there. Excellent work, guys. Again, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Once you've got your breath back, then find your pulse. And again, we're going to take it, take that uh, heart rate to find it. If you need to pause the video to find it, then that's fine. Right, in your 10 seconds, start now. Out 
and stop there. Well done. So again, find that number times by six and then write it down for your next result. If you need to get a quick drink, then go and grab a quick drink and then pause the video here and then come back once you've had one. Right, our next activity is going to be sprints on the spot, okay? Now, for this one, we're going to do 10 second sprints, okay? And then once we've done our 10 second sprint, we're gonna do a 10 second walk around the area, okay? And then we're gonna go back into our 10 second sprint. So, standing up. Okay, I'm just gonna get the timer. Right, 10 seconds. So, I wanna see them legs pumping, them arms pumping. Okay, nice and fast, like we did in our warm-up. Okay, see how fast you can get your legs to go. Are we ready? Three, two, one, and go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and stop. Okay, so slow walk around the area. Hands on your head if you need to, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Good. And ready to go again. And go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, last 5 seconds, put it in. And stop there. Again, slow walk around the area. Hands on your head, getting that breathing going. Hands on your head, getting that breathing going. And coming down and taking your pulse. Find that pulse for me. If you need to pause the video to find it, that's fine. Right. Rest of you ready, 10 seconds from now. And stop. Well done, good. Right, we're on our last activity now. So for our last one, we're gonna do tricep dips. Now some of you might not know what a tricep dip is. Some of you will, okay. So you will need to find something like a chair or a sofa. Okay, you're going to put your arms, sit on the sofa to start with, okay, then when I say go, you're going to move your feet forward, so your bum is now not on your seat, okay, and then you're going to lower yourself down, keeping your legs straight and back up, okay, and we're going to do that for 15 seconds, okay, so keeping your legs straight, try not to bend them. If, if you need to bend them, then that is fine. Okay, so you could do it like this. Okay, that is just as good. Okay, if you are going for legs straight, then keep them nice and straight. Right, get into a ready position. If you need to pause the video here to go and find something to work with, okay, so like a chair or something, then that is fine. Then come back when you're ready. Right, the rest of us. 15 seconds. Ready and go. And stop there, well done, excellent. Again, if you need to get up and shake your body out, take them deep breaths in, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Okay, shake your arms off if you need to. And then back into your position, ready to go. And go. Another 15 seconds. You've got eight seconds left. And stop there. Well done, great work. So this time I want you just to walk around. So you've got 20 seconds just to get that breath back. Okay. Walking around. In through the nose, out through the mouth. As we've said the whole way through. 
Good, and then once you've done that, come down, take your, find your pulse. Again, if you need to pause the video to find it, then pause it. And then take your heart rate, ready, and go. And stop. Well done. Remember that number times by six. Okay, excellent work. Now, got a bit of a challenge for you now. If you've still got lots of energy, okay, can you come up with your own interval training circuit? Okay, so can you come up with some other things that we haven't done? So you might do sit-ups, burpees, there's lots of different things that you can do. Okay, so that's what I would like you to do now. If you are worn out, then that is fine. I would leave it today and then maybe come up with another one another time okay so maybe tomorrow that might, might might be what you do for your exercise tomorrow okay so before we go we are going to do a quick cool down okay so for our cool down what i would like us to do is we're going to walk around the area every five steps okay you're going to get into a nice squat position and hold it for three seconds okay and then start walking around so one two Three, four, five, squat position. And then go again. That's it. Keep nice and still in that position. Perfect. Again, going in different directions. Don't just keep going in straight lines. Two more. Remember to keep your breathing good. And last one, just to walk around. Last one. And excellent guys right guys now if you feel like you need to stretch your muscles off okay that is fine feel like you need to stretch them do the same stretches we did at the start okay we have reached the end of the lesson I hope you've got a lot out of today and I will see you next time <laughs>